Hi, hello, my dears. Happy to meet you again. Welcome back to English class. And I hope you remember Velasco. Do you remember him? Where is he now? Yes, he is in the Caribbean Sea. And what happened to his shipmates? Four shipmates, Carabello, Castillo, Aden, Rengifo and Herrera. What happened to them? Yes, they sank in the sea. Now, alone, Velasco was in the life raft. Okay, let us uh, read what happened to him. Ready? Listen here. K11 paragraph. Keep your textbook with you and write down the meanings in your text itself. Okay, ready? Let's read. I don't know how long I stayed like that, balancing in the life raft, holding out the oar. I kept searching the water, hoping that someone would surface soon. But the sea was clear and the wind, getting stronger, blew against my shirt like the howl of a dog. The cargo had disappeared. The mast, growing more distinct, proved that the small ship hadn't sunk, as I had first thought. I felt calm. I thought that one of my mates had managed to reach the other life raft. Okay. I don't know how long I stayed like that. I. Who is I here? Yes, Velasco. Julius Alejandro Velasco. Okay. I don't know how long I stayed like that, balancing in the life raft, holding out the oar. Don't you remember? Velasco had hold out the oar for Rengifo to catch. But what happened to Rengifo? Yes, he sank in the sea. Okay. So, how long? What will be how long? How much time? Etra neiram. How long? I don't know how long I stayed like that, holding the oar. I kept searching the water, hoping that someone would surface soon. So now, Velasco was watching the sea, looking at the water, observing the sea. What is What was his hope? Someone, some of his shipmates would surface soon. What will be surface? Surface. What will be surface? Come up. And it is a verb. And don't we know surface of a table? What will be surface of a table? Yes, uh, that is the top part of the table. But here, surface is uh, used as a verb. But it means come up, come to the top part. Okay, yes. Someone, someone would surface soon, but the sea was clear and the wind getting stronger blew against my shirt. The wind, the wind was become stronger and stronger. Getting stronger blew against my shirt. Stronger, what do you mean stronger? Yes, strong, stronger, ah, you know. Getting stronger blew against my shirt like the Howl of a dog. Howl of a dog. Howl? What do you mean by howl? And usually, what is a dog doing? Yes, a dog is barking. Then, what do you mean by howl? What is the difference between a howl and a bark? Don't you know? How a dog is barking? Ah, yes, bow, bow. And howling? Oiriduga. They are the two different sounds. Don't you know? 
yes okay so here is the howl of a dog so so the wind is blowing and the sound is sound is like the howl of a dog like don't you remember simile <laughs> okay the cargo had disappeared the cargo cargo goods had disappeared the mast growing more distinct proved that the small ship had in sunk the mast mast don't you remember the picture i uh, showed you in the last class mast uh, the post the vertical post to uh, stitch the or to tie the what the sail kappal paaya kettanulla post that is mast the mast growing more distinct what in the distinct distinct say the word distinct clear distinct clear okay very clear distinct growing more distinct so the mast is seen very clear now okay can you get the idea the mast of the ship his ship is very clear now proved that the small ship had in sunk the small ship their ship the ship they were sailing was it had in sunk no it had in sunk it was there in the sea as i had first thought uh, what was the thought of velasco at first their ship had sunk in the sea their ship had sunk in the sea but now he knew knew that the ship is on the sea what is the difference between in the sea and on the sea in the sea means it had sunk on the sea it is sailing through the water okay now i felt calm i felt calm calm quiet no stress no tension i felt calm i thought that one of my mates had managed to reach the other life raft so there were two life rafts one is uh, here with velasco and velasco thinks that the other one of his friends should have reached the other life raft okay mattedil aarengilum oru theerchayayum etti kaanum that is there was no reason they shouldn't have reached it the rafts weren't provisioned in fact none of the life rafts of the small ship was outfitted but there were six of them apart from the robots and the whalers it was reasonable to believe that some of my mates had reached the other life rafts as i had reached mine and perhaps the destroyer was searching for us okay there was no reason they shouldn't have reached it they they means other shipmates the other people in the ship shouldn't have reached it etti cheraadirikkan kaaranam onnum illa the raft were in provisioned the raft raft life raft were not provisioned provision what do you mean provision how did you heard of provision store provision store from uh, where we buy food items all the food items raw food items and other food items store provision store we get food items from the provision store so provision means food items so here what is the sentence the rafts were not provisioned that is there were no food items in the life raft get the idea there were no food items in the life raft okay the rafts were not provisioned in fact 
none of the life rafts of small ship was outfitted none of the life raft of the small ship was outfitted none of no one none means no one no life raft of the small ship was outfitted outfitted the real meaning of outfitted is clothing clothes don't you know clothes ah this our clothes so outfit means clothes but here what it means is that there is no extra fitting or no food items in the life raft no extra fitting cloth is an extra fitting for us isn't it yes vastram anyondana nammal janichu virunnathu no so cloth is an extra fitting an outfit okay so here it means that there is no extra fitting in the life raft okay nothing only the a boat life boat and an oar that's all okay but there were six of them apart from the robots and the whalers but there were six of them in their ship in their small ship there were six life rafts six life rafts apart from the robots and the whalers apart from apart from kudade adu adu kudade vera endakke undayirunno the robots robots boat we can row using an oar that is robots and the whalers whalers say the word whalers haven't you heard of blue whales yes what is the peculiarity of blue whales yeah you know the biggest animal on earth isn't it yes blue whales and which is the biggest animal on land elephant you know and whales are blue whales are the biggest animal on earth have you ever seen a blue whale i will show you yes this is the picture of a blue whale stranded on a beach a blue whale how big it is and you know ah, this is another blue whale stranded in a uh, in a shore in a beach in a shore okay whalers means a particular type of ship using or boat used to hunt whales okay used to hunt whales തിമിങ്ങനത്തെ പിടിക്കാൻ ഉപയോഗിക്കുന്ന എ പെർട്ടിക്കുലർ ടൈപ്പ് ഓഫ് ബോട്ട് ദാറ്റ് ഇസ് നോൺ ആസ് വെയിലേഴ്സ് സോ ദർ ആർ സിക്സ് ലൈഫ് റാഫ്സ് റോബോട്ട്സ് ആൻഡ് വെയിലേഴ്സ് ഇറ്റ് വാസ് റീസണബിൾ ടു ബിലീവ് ദാറ്റ് സം ഓഫ് മൈ മേറ്റ്സ് ഹാഡ് റീച്ച് വിത്ത് ദ അതർ ലൈഫ് റാഫ്സ് ഇറ്റ് വാസ് റീസണബിൾ വോട്ട് യു ബി റീസണബിൾ യുക്തി പരം ന്യായമായും ന്യായമായും നമുക്ക് ചിന്തിക്കാം ഇറ്റ് വാസ് റീസണബിൾ റീസൺ ഉള്ളതാണ് റീസണബിൾ ഇറ്റ് വാസ് റീസണബിൾ യുക്തിസഹം യുക്തിയുള്ളതാണ് ടു ബിലീവ് ദാറ്റ് സം ഓഫ് മൈ മേറ്റ്സ് ഹാഡ് റീച്ച് വിത്ത് ദ അതർ ലൈഫ് റാഫ്സ് സം ഓഫ് ദ മൈ മേറ്റ്സ് ദർ ആർ സോ മെനി പീപ്പിൾ ഇൻ ദ ബോട്ട് ഇൻ ദ സ്മോൾ ബോട്ട് ആൻഡ് സം ഓഫ് ദം ഹാവ് റീച്ച് ദ സം ഓഫ് ദ robots or whalers or uh, the life rafts that is velasco thinking as i had reached the mine and perhaps the destroyer was searching for us and perhaps what is this word perhaps uri pachi what is the meaning of perhaps uri pachi perhaps the destroyer was searching for us destroyer who will be destroyer i will show you destroyer this is a destroyer destroyer is a naval naval terminology used for a small fast warship 
which escort large ships in a fleet. Yudha kapparigal pombo, a vellu yudha kapparigal anandha avaga. Adine anigamikinna, valare fast aitula, valare strong aitula, chariya yudha kapparigal ayana, uh, naviga senayil. Navy means naviga senayil, destroyer in nariya pedaga. Okay, destroyer. So, destroyer is a small warship. Fast, small, fast warship. Okay. Perhaps the destroyer was searching for us. So, their ship was a destroyer. A small, fast warship. And Vesco is thinking that that ship may be searching for us. Very soon, I was aware of the sun, a midday sun, hoped and metallic, stupefied, not fully recovered. I looked at my watch. It was noon on the doubt. Okay. Very soon, I was aware of the sun, aware. I became aware. I knew, I understood. Aware of the sun. A midday sun. Midday. Noon. Hot and metallic. Metallic like a metal. Stupefied. Not fully recovered. I looked at my watch. Stupefied. What do you mean stupefied? Say the word. Stupefied. Once more, stupefied. What do you mean by stupefied? Unable to think properly. A stage when we are not able to think properly. That is stupefied. Not fully recovered. Recovered from the shock. Recovered. Retchapadaga. Retchapadu. Not fully recovered. Retchapadu to lya shokil nena. I looked at my watch. It was noon on the dot. What is the time of noon? Yes, 12 o'clock. Noon means 12 o'clock. Okay. The last time, Renjifu had asked me the time. On the small ship, it was 11.30. I had checked the time again and the disaster had not occurred. The last time Rejifo had asked me the time on the small ship, it was 11.30. 11.30. Now it is 12 o'clock. I had checked the time again and the disaster had not occurred. Disaster. What do you mean by disaster? Say the word. Disaster. Once more. Disaster. What do you mean by disaster? Disaster means Duryandam. The accident. Accident in a vakini kailam malayana vakana kuchudi of yojikale. Duryandam. Disaster. Okay. So the disaster had not had occurred. Occurred. Happened. What was the disaster here? What was the disaster? Yes. The wreck of their ship. The wreck of their ship. Shipwreck. Okay. When I looked at my watch on the life raft, it was exactly noon. It had taken only 10 minutes for everything to happen. For me to reach the life raft, and try to rescue my shipmates and stand motionless in the raft, searching the empty sea, listening to the sharp howl of the wind. I thought it would take them at least two or three hours to rescue me. Okay. When I looked at my watch on the life raft, it was exactly noon. The correct time is 12 o'clock. So only... 30 minutes now. It had taken only 10 minutes for everything to happen. 
So within 10 minutes, there was a shipwreck. Within 10 minutes, there was a shipwreck. For me to reach the life raft. After the wreck, Velasco had reached the life raft. And tried to rescue my shipmates. Rescue. Save. S-A-V-E. Save. Rescue. Say the word. Rescue. Once more. Rescue. What do you mean by rescue? Save. Recha padithaga. Recha pravartanam. Rescue mission. Haven't you heard? Uh, when there is a flood in Kerala in uh, 2018. And every time there were, uh, if there is a disaster, there is the rescue mission. What do you mean rescue mission? Recha Dautyam. So here rescue, Recha Padataga. Rescue my shipmates and stand motionless in the raft. Stand motionless, motionless, without motion. Without movement, motionless, without any movement. In the raft, searching the empty sea, listening to the sharp howl of the wind. So now, Velasco was in the, sh in the boat, in the life raft. I thought it would take them at least two or three hours to rescue me. Someone will come to rescue me. And within two or three hours, they will come to rescue me. That is the thought of Velasco. Okay. Two or three hours, I calculated. It seemed an extraordinarily long time to be alone at sea. But I tried to resign myself to it. I had no food or water and by three in the afternoon I would surely have a searing thirst. The sun burned my heart and my skin which was dry and hardened by salt. Since I had lost my cap I splashed the water on my head and I just sat on the side of the raft waiting to be rescued. Two or three hours I calculated, two or three hours to be rescued. It seemed an extraordinarily long time, extraordinarily. Say the word, extraordinarily. Once more please. Extraordinarily, asadharanam. Extraordinarily long time. Uh, is three hours a long time? No, but where is Velasco now? In the sea. Alone in the sea. Nothing. No one is there and nothing is there. There is nothing to eat, nothing to drink. So, he is alone in the sea. That's why it becomes an extraordinarily long time. He is alone in the sea without food or water. Without any company, companion, without any friend. Okay. So, extraordinarily long time to be alone at the sea. Alone. What do you mean alone? Or take it. But I tried to resign myself to it. I tried to resign myself to it. Resign. Resign. Namalakko oru resign gate it in Avinchalapo. Joli il nina resign jayaga. But here, there is uh, another meaning, resign. Resign means accept as inevitable. Accept the thing. That is, that is the meaning of resign. Accept as inevitable. That means, where is Velasco now? In the sea. And uh, he can be saved by someone else. Someone will come to save him. So uh, he accepts his condition. I am alone in the sea and I have to wait here for someone to come and save him. So that is the meaning of resign. Okay. But I try to resign myself to it. 
I had no food or water. And by three in the afternoon, I would surely have a searing thirst. By three o'clock in the afternoon, I would surely have a searing thirst. Thirst, ah, thirst, daham, you know. Searing thirst, searing. What, do you, what is this word? Searing. It means very hot and dry. Searing means very hot and dry. Dry yoga. Searing thirst. What do you mean? Searing thirst. The sun burned my head and my skin. Burned. Sun burned. Irikino. Surian Tibole and Nadu Kadalile Nala Natucha. So what is the can you imagine that hot? Can you feel that hot? That is. The sun burned my head and my skin, which was dry and hardened by salt. Dry and hardened. Harden Katiai. Kati Gudi. Salt very very sea now in the sea. What is the specialty of sea water? Salt, salty water. So, with the salt, his uh, hair and skin became hardened. Okay. Since I had lost my cap, I splashed the water on my head. Cap, hat. He lost his cap. There is no hat. So, he splashed the water on my head. Splashed the Ah, yes, well, I'm going to Splash the water on my head and I just sat on the side of the raft waiting to be rescued. Can you imagine Velasco sitting on the raft with splashing water on his head? Yes. It was only then that I felt the pain in my right knee. The thick Blue drill fabric of my trouser leg was wet. So I had a hard time rolling it up. But when I did, I was startled. I saw a deep half moon shaped wound on the lower part of my knee. Okay. It was only then that I felt the pain in my right knee. Pain Vedana. In my right knee. Knee. Mutta, you know. So, on my right knee, I felt a pain. Itre neram pain arnila. Karanam, Vulbar terkila, you know. Life raft to lethanum, so the clay chickanum. So, he was busy with that thing. So, he didn't feel the pain. But now, he is sitting on the life raft and he felt the pain on his right knee. Valadu mutila. The thick blue drill fabric. Drill fabric. And I will show you the drill fabric. Look. And I think you are familiar with this. This is drill fabric. Drill fabric means a strong cotton fabric. Durable and strong cotton fabric. Remember jeans ah, like that. That is. Okay. The thick blue drill fabric of my trouser leg was wet. Ningada jeans in the pants and nananyal. Mughal leki churiti katana mingle. Isn't it a difficult thing? Yeah, like this, like that. Here. My trouser leg was wet. So I had a hard time rolling it up. Rolling it up. Ah, that is. Rolling it up. I had a hard time to rolling it up, to roll the uh, leg of my trouser. But when I did, I was startled. When I did, when I rolled up the leg of my trouser, I startled. Startled. Look at this word. Startled. Say once more. Startled. What, what, what do you mean by startled? Surprised. Startled. Surprised. Okay. I was startled. 
I saw a deep half moon shaped wound on the lower part of my knee. I saw a deep, deep, half moon shaped wound. Half moon shaped. What do you mean half moon shaped? Yes, this is a half moon shape. Half moon shaped wound. Wound moriva. On the lower part of my knee. Lower part? Tariula bhagam. Lower part of my knee. I didn't know if I had gashed it on the side of the ship. I don't know if I had gashed it. Gashed. Gashed. Or maybe gashed. Cut open. Gashed means cut open. Vidipo muruva patti. Eppayana muruva patti edana. I don't know. That is the meaning. I gashed it on the side. On the side of the ship. Or if it had happened when I hit the water. Raft like a repayano, ship in the water like Vina Poyano. I don't know when it had happened. When it had happened. For I didn't notice it until I was seated in the life raft. Only when I was sitting in the life raft, I noticed the pain and the wound. Wound, what do you mean wound? W O U N D wound. Moreover. Though the wound burned a little, it had stopped the bleeding. Though the wound burned a little, burned eriyuga yenna, but here neeruga. Muruva neeruga le chayinada, yes. Though the wound burned a little, though ingilam, though ingilam, though the wound burned a little, it had stopped the bleeding. And was completely dry. Stopped the bleeding. No blood in the wound. And it was completely dry. No wet blood there. Because of the salt water, I imagine. Muruvila, salt water patiapo and the bleeding in no no blood there in the wound. Okay. Uncertain as to what to do, I decided to make an inventory of my belongings. I wanted to figure out what I could count on in my solitude at sea. First of all, I could rely on my watch, which kept perfect time, and which I couldn't stop glancing at every two or three minutes. In addition, I had my gold ring, which I had bought in Cartagena the year before and a chain with a medal of the Virgin of Carmen on it. Also purchased in Cartagena from another sailor for 35 pesos. In my pockets, I had nothing but the keys to my locker on the small ship and three business cards I had been given at a store in mobile one day in January when I had gone out shopping. Since I had nothing to do, I read the cards over and over to distract myself until I was rescued. Okay. Uncertain as to what to do. Uncertain. Not sure. Uncertain. Certain? Sure. So uncertain? Not sure. I am not sure what to do. I don't know what to do. I decided to make an inventory of my belongings. Inventory. Say the word. Inventory. Once more. Inventory. Inventory means a detailed list of all the items in stock. Inventory. A detailed list of all the items in stock. List. List of goods. 
നമ്മുടെ കയ്യിലുള്ള സാധനങ്ങളുടെ ലിസ്റ്റ് ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് ഇൻവെൻറ്ററി ദ ക്യാൻ ഇൻവെൻറ്ററി ഓഫ് മൈ ബിലോങ്ങിങ്സ് ബിലോങ്ങിങ്സ് വട്ട് യു ബി ബിലോങ്ങിങ്സ് സേ ദ വേർഡ് ബിലോങ്ങിങ്സ് മീൻസ് പൊസഷൻസ് ബിലോങ്ങിങ് മീൻസ് പൊസഷൻസ് നമ്മുടെ സ്വന്തമായ വസ്തുക്കൾ ബിലോങ്ങിങ്സ് പൊസഷൻസ് ഓക്കെ so i decided to make an inventory of my belongings i am going to list out what are the things i have now okay i wanted to figure out what i could count on in my solitude at sea i wanted to figure out figure out krithyamai rekhe undakuga figure out what i could count on what do you mean by count on yes count on means rely on someone or something aasrayikkuga en artham okay i could count on in my solitude at sea solitude egandada solitude egandada so i was alone in the sea and i want to do something so what is velasco doing he is going to list out the things he had okay first of all i could rely on my watch rely on count on rely on means count on aasrayikkuga i could rely on my watch which kept perfect time krithya samayam correct time and which i couldn't stop glancing at every 2 or 3 minutes glancing looking say the word glancing or you may glancing looking so velasco is looking at the watch looking at the watch in every 2 or 3 minutes when we are alone we are prone to look at the watch സമയന്തായി സമയന്തായി നീ നോക്കിക്കൊണ്ടേയിരിക്കും സോ എവറി ടു ഓർ ത്രീ മിനിറ്റ്സ് ഇൻ അഡീഷൻ ഐ ഹാഡ് മൈ ഗോൾഡ് റിങ് ഗോൾഡ് റിങ് റിങ് യെസ് മോതിര ഗോൾഡ് റിങ് വിച്ച് ഐ ഹാഡ് ബോട്ട് ഇൻ കാർട്ടേജിന ദ ഇയർ ബിഫോർ ഐ ഹാഡ് ബോട്ട് ഇൻ കാർട്ടേജിന കാർട്ടേജിന ഡോൺ യു റിമെമ്പർ ദ ഇയർ സ്റ്റാർട്ടിങ് ഫ്രം കാർട്ടേജിന കമ്മിങ് ഫ്രം കാർട്ടേജിന ദ ഇയർ ബിഫോർ ആൻഡ് എ ചെയിൻ with a medal of virgin of Car- carmen a chain yes this is a chain like that mala chain with a medal of virgin of carmen virgin of carmen and medal of virgin of carmen i will show you yes this is a medal of virgin of carmen this is like this that's all locket nammal parayna locket that's all a medal of the virgin of carmen on it also purchased in cartagena purchased what do you mean purchased the purchase ne povuga don't you know yes purchase bought in cartagena from another sailor for 30 pesos 30 pesos pesos means a type of coin uh, i will show you yes this is a peso peso is a coin that originated in spain a coin in spain that is pesos that's all like our paisa paisa don't you know like that pesos 30 pesos okay in my pockets i had nothing but the keys to my locker on the small ship in my pocket only the uh, keys to the locker on the small ship നമുക്ക് ഓരോ കുഞ്ഞു കുഞ്ഞു അലമാര വരെ ഷിപ്പിലൊക്കെ ചെല്ലുമ്പോൾ ഇവർക്ക് വോർഷിപ്പ് അല്ലേ ഇതോ സോ അവരുടെ സാധനങ്ങൾ സൂക്ഷിക്കാനുള്ള ഒരു കുഞ്ഞ് അലമാര ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് ലോക്കർ ഓരോ ഓരോ അലമാര ഓരോരുത്തർക്ക് അങ്ങനെയല്ല ഒരു വലിയ അലമാര ഉണ്ടാവും അതിലെ ഓരോ ഭാഗം ഓരോ ഡ്രോയർ ഓരോരുത്തർക്ക് കൊടുക്കും ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് ലോക്കർ കീസ് ടു മൈ ലോക്കർ ഓൺ ദ സ്മോൾ ഷിപ്പ് ആൻഡ് ത്രീ ബിസിനസ് കാർഡ്സ് ഐ ഹാഡ് ബീൻ ഗിവൺ അറ്റ് എ സ്റ്റോർ ഇൻ മൊബൈൽ വൺ ഡേ ഇൻ ജാനുവരി ബിസിനസ് കാർഡ്സ് നമുക്ക് കാർഡുകൾ കിട്ടുമല്ലോ ഓരോരുത്തർ അവരവരുടെ വിസിറ്റിംഗ് കാർഡ് തരുമല്ലോ ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് വിസിറ്റിംഗ് കാർഡ
business cards i had been given at a store in mobile mobile <laughs> mobile is the name of a place in usa in america i will show you so this is the map map of mobile and it is a port city turumukha nagaravana in alabama america that is so mobile one day in january when i had gone out shopping so he got some cards visiting cards that's all since i had nothing to do i read the cards over and over to distract myself until i was rescued since i had nothing to do in the middle of the sea alone in a life raft what can he do nothing so he read the cards over and over again to distract myself distract say the word distract wouldn't be distract draw someone's attention away from something onnil ninnu shraddha maatuga distract shraddha onnil ninnu maatunadiniyana distract ennu parayya distract say the word okay so distract myself ende shraddha njan ingane kadalilokke kaanu enna chindayil ninnu maatan vendi njan aa kaadugal eduthu vaichu that is i read the cards over and over to distract myself until i was rescued so now velasco was in the sea in the life raft and he hoped that someone will come to rescue him okay so that's all in our text and it's a novel and it has 16 chapters we have read only one chapter in the middle and you know what happened yes after drifting with sea currents for 10 days he arrives with his raft on a coast that he later discovers to be columbia aarum rakshikan vannilla pagaram 10 divasa inge olgi 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 nadanna avasanam columbia ide theerathu life raft mai chenna adigeyirunnu jeevanoda thane kitti adeham jeevichu vannu 66 amathe vayasile 70 amathe vayasilana he is Uh, he suffered a shipwreck and he died only in the 66 or 68th year when he died he was uh, 68 years old so velasco was not rescued from the sea but he arrives with his raft on a coast that is and uh, that is all for the ship wreck the sailor now okay so uh, read the uh, text read these paragraphs so many times and come to class and we can read the this paragraphs once more uh, in the paragraph not uh, i but you you will read uh, in the class and we can uh, discuss the question answers there okay So see you in the next class till then bye bye